for free from any of these manufacturers I do this as a hobby I give a review on something that I think is cool maybe it helps somebody maybe it doesn't but nothing here is for free I buy it with all my own money I give you my own opinion I tell you what I'm gonna do with it that's it I'm not here to sell anything for anyone or get anything for free just wanted to let you know that enjoy my channel whenever you stop by, and thanks for watching. Bye. they could do the modification similar to that but on a modern RC transmitter so here's how it arrived from China this is probably transmitter in many many years this year I've had this since I uh, got married it's got a lot of miles on it it's pretty crusty but I converted it into a single stick just got the throttle over here no rudder rudder yaw and pitch well, they're all over here. I used to fly helicopters and quarter-scale gassers with this. And it did, did wonders. But this technology is old. Almost as outdated as these craft radios. I mean, this is really old school right here. It is very, very old school. Look at that. 1993. It's pretty damn old. World Engines. And this other single stick here, this is a craft radio. It's got, I think it still has the battery in it. Anyway, these were obtained up there in uh, Ulster County, New York. 26,995 is the frequency on this one. Of course, I don't have any transmitters or servos or anything that came with them but they're pretty badass for what they are way back in the day somebody's using this one on a boat there it is it's pretty cool i chose to get the blue one Yes, that's what I ordered. Pretty cool. All right, this is the money shot right here. Modern transmitter with single stick style 
joysticks. 900 megahertz and 2.4 gigahertz. Dual band transmitter. This is pretty cool. Look at that, that is freaking awesome. Nice, it's a good feeling radio. Nicest radio I've had in a long time. So, along the way, I was considering the German Gropner radios, but they were too limited in their programming. I considered modifying a newer Spectrum NX10 with this joystick. It's not that difficult to modify a radio. It'd be for your yaw and your pitch. And then you have your wires for your, your rudder. And you just slide these over to the other side of the radio. And, uh, you'd be good to go. I still might do it. Depends. If I can get my children interested in flying, I might still convert uh, a newer radio into a joystick for them. We'll see how the future goes. But it is possible. It's not hard. I think this was like $13 on eBay. Not a big deal. So what else comes in here? We got the radio. Put that baby right there. And we got <clears throat> the neck strap. You've already seen that. I don't need to take it out. And we got some stuff up in here. Different springs for the joysticks. And here are the sticks that actually came off because the uh, Horus RC people over in China actually converted this radio so that I didn't have to take it apart and do it myself. I think that's pretty badass. Those are the paperwork, you've already seen that. I'm just showing you the joystick version of this radio. You've already seen plenty of unboxing videos. You don't need to see any more super detailed baloney on that. Anyway, we have this radio and it's pretty cool. So what we have here for future plans is because I have to go back to work in a couple days. I don't have time. I have reinstated my AMA card. So that's the first time since 2005 that I've had my AMA membership. And I have joined the West Pasco Model Pilots Association. I have with me already a carbon cub that I'm going to start flying when I come back. And then these, all well, this gear, is going to be for a uh, 30cc Hangar 9 stick. This receiver, the TDR18, is for this radio. The old band receivers with redundant power supply. It's got three antennas, one inside and two on the outside. I have another single stick radio coming in a couple months that uses these receivers along with this flight controller. And that'll be exciting. I'll do that video probably in December. I'm sure I'll have it. I have to, I have a lot of work to do until then. But I'm looking forward to that. Looking forward to flying all, all over the winter.